How's it going, guys? Today, I'm going to talk about the first draft pick in NBA history, named Clifton McNeely. Well, let's just dive right into it. Clifton McNeely was born on June 22nd of 1919 in Greenwood, Texas, to Albert McNeely and Fannie Lee Clifton. Now, as you probably just realized, Clifton's first name comes from his mother's last name. Anyways, <laughs> growing up in Greenwood, Clifton McNeely would fall in love with the game of basketball and would go on to play it for the Greenwood High School basketball team. After Clifton's junior year, he would transfer to Slidell High School, located in Slidell, Texas, and would be a star on their basketball team. After his graduation from Slidell, he would attend a Dallas, Texas college named Decatur Baptist, where he would set so many records on their basketball team. The man was basically a god for them. After Clifton McNeely's 1940 season with the team, he transferred to Texas Wesleyan University, where he would automatically gain attention on their basketball team for his, and I quote, shot crazy style. The team wasn't so sure if he could fit in with them, but they would swiftly come to the realization that he could, as he would become one of their star players. Clifton was so good that in his second season with the team, he would get named team captain. Now, as a team captain, Clifton would lead Texas Wesleyan to an undefeated record. The team's only losses would come in their 1942 postseason games against the San Diego Bearcats and the San Diego Toreros. During the middle of Clifton's 1943 season with the team, he would leave to serve the U.S. Army in World War II. During his time there, he would play on a lot of the Army's basketball teams. After leaving the military in 1945, he would receive a lot of professional basketball contract offers, but would turn all of them down to instead go back to playing on the Texas Wesleyan basketball team. Clifton McNeely's 1946-47 season with the team would be spectacular, as he not only lead the team to a 30-4 record, but would lead the NIA in scoring with 725 points. Clifton would finish this final college basketball season of his, leading Texas Wesleyan to a conference championship title. After his time in college was over, he'd get selected by the Pittsburgh Ironmen in the inaugural 1947 BAA draft as the first pick, making him the first person ever drafted into the NBA, as the BAA would soon transform into the NBA. Shockingly for the Pittsburgh Ironmen, their first overall pick, Clifton McNeely, wouldn't be interested in playing for them and would not sign with them. The man was just never into pro basketball to begin with. Anyways, this decision by Clifton would cause the Pittsburgh team to fold before the start of the 1947-48 season. Damn. <laughs> A basketball player single-handedly caused the dismantling of a professional basketball team. How many times have you heard a story like that? <laughs> Anyways, Clinton McNeely would go on to never play an ounce of NBA basketball and would instead become a high school coach at Pampa, Texas, where he went on to lead their basketball team to four state titles. After retiring from being a coach in 1960, he would work in school administration all over Texas up until the year of 1985. 
On December 26 of 2003, in Irving, Texas, at the age of 84, Clifton McNeely would pass away. Rest in peace. Now, before I end this video, I want to share with you guys some fun Clifton McNeely facts. Number one, he made all NAIA first team in 1947. Number two, he held the Texas Wesleyan single season scoring record for over 60 years until a guy named Chris Berry broke it in the team's 2009 season with 740 points. Number three, Clifton is nicknamed and I quote, the man of a million shots. Number four, in 1977, he was inducted into the Texas Wesleyan University Hall of Fame. And last but not least, number five, Clifton McNeely, along with a guy named Gene Melchior, are the only two number one draft picks in NBA history to never play an NBA game. One guy could have played and chose not to. The other guy was just straight up banned. <laughs> well guys, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Basket maker out. Peace.